Hey everybody and welcome to another tutorial by none other than me, Lennox. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to Photoshop yourself, yourself, and as many of the other yourselves as you want into one photo. Now to do this, you're going to want to put your camera in one stable place, put it onto a timer mode, 2 seconds, 5 seconds, 10 seconds, something, click it, run to your desired position and just wait a second once the camera takes the picture repeat it another time as many times as you want i'm only doing two for now so you can make this tutorial nice easy and fast now once you have those pictures you're going to open them up in photoshop and all you're going to do is copy one photo Oops. You're going to copy one photo onto the next. Just paste it. Now all you're going to do is, simple as this, delete within this layer where the other person is. Match it up. If you look closely, It was originally just a little off, making the couch look weird. But if you match it up, it seems about right now. Oh, wait, I deleted my head. So sometimes you gotta be careful. You just match it up. There you go. Sometimes you want to hit it, just go to image, auto color it. So it tries its best to match it up. Sometimes it doesn't work. A way around that, obviously, would be to cut out yourself and make sure it's on similar layers. Now, I'm quite lazy, so for this tutorial, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to go to magic wand, just delete some spot, oops. And as you can see, it slowly matches up colors and whatnot. I'm lazy, so I'm not gonna do it all. I'm gonna show you an easier way. Take the fill, put it down to about 90. Then, what you do is you go into your actions panel. Actions allows you to do multiple steps in a quick and easy fashion. I'll post one of my favorite packs of actions down in this uh, link bar, description bar, whatever. So all you do is window, actions. You go pick out whatever you want. I have plenty of actions. One of my favorites is time, or I even have a 3D action. Oops. Right. For most of these actions, they only work for one layer at a time. So you're going to want to combine these layers by highlighting both of them. Press shift, right? And then you press Apple E or Command E, whatever you want to call it. Simple as that. Then you go back to your action, press play. Add a little contrast. Press OK. Oh, snap. 3D. Not only is it 3D, but it's two of you. So, easy as that. So, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Make sure once you're done, add a little lettering so that people know who you are. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Hope you understand what to do. I hope your pictures come out pretty awesome. So, this is the end. Subscribe, rate, comment, and have fun.